Hello, my name is Nicholas Ogango. My sign name is Nicholas. And you, what's your sign? We are name. My name is Kevin Ongwesu. My sign name is Kevin. Okay. I wanted today to know more about deaf culture because many hearing people don't understand the deaf culture. I tell you this one, boo boo, or deaf. No. But now I want you to tell us about the deaf culture. What? The deaf culture, the hearing see and want to understand. Example, when calling a deaf, how do you call a deaf? Let me show you. You call by tapping at the shoulder and the deaf person will realize that this person is calling me. Don't take a stone and throw at the deaf. Just tap. Next, when walking, on the, on the way and the hearing starts voicing it. When the deaf is walking, you just throw outside, not at the deaf. Throw outside and the deaf will look back and check who is calling. So, mostly the deaf use eyes to see. Now, what do you think about the deaf culture groups? The deaf may be walking and see a signer there. They all move to the signer. Why? They all depend. If they see a person towards signing or interpreting sign language well, they all will draw attention to the signer. They love that and they see that the signer cares. If the person see a person signing or signer, they all enjoy because that is a way of communicating now. If possible, maybe a deaf person gets an accident and breaks the hand. How will this deaf person communicate? The deaf don't have hands. It's possible for that person to be moved in a special school, deaf blind school. In a deaf blind school, they use touching, braille, to communicate now you say they the deaf has lost their hands they will use their the legs they will train to communicate it's important one the deaf to use sign language two facial expression when you're showing sadness happiness use my smile show sadness yeah if maybe there's death how do you show that maybe your parent is dead your facial expression will show that you feel angry or sad if maybe your team wins how will you express that you'll feel happy now i understand kevin I have stress a lot and worry as to why deaf people marry deaf. For example, me, I'm a deaf man and I meet a deaf girl, I marry. But a deaf man, when he meets a hearing girl, they avoid marrying. Why? First thing is sign language. If you know sign language and you can be able to communicate comfortably, I will feel comfortable to marry. To avoid communication barrier.
Now I understand. Mm -hmm. Now the deaf want to see sign language well. Meaning, you adv advise Kenya must have sign language to all the people, hearing and the deaf. That will help to communicate well. Kenya, in the Kenya constitution, we have three languages that are official. We have English, we have Kiswahili, we have sign language there. All the hearing must learn the sign language, if possible, to help a person know. <laughs> Kevin is telling that he loves sign language. For example, at night. At night. How do deaf communicate? Because there is a problem. Meaning, you must have light. In deaf culture, it's important to have light. True? When signing, you must see well. Same in class. In school, the children, they sit in a room in class, and the room must have good lighting from the windows. The doors must be open so that their children can see the blackboard. So if you close close the windows, the doors, the children will not be able to see. Meaning, the deaf people, when they meet, they must have seat in front there. If it's in church, in front, where they can see the preacher and the interpreter, you must not block the deaf. Maybe when meeting in politics, rallies, the deaf must move closer to the interpreter so that they can see well, they should not stand far. In social media, for example, the interpreter on TV, it's, they have a small space so it is impossible for the deaf to see. The space should be wide. Now, I see the problem here. Kevin is complaining because TV there, we, the person that is interpreting is using a small space and that is a big problem. Now, I am thinking that Kenya must think hard. If TV, they just expand the signing space so that the deaf can see well. It's very important and very important information that must have good space. Same when the interpreter must use one color on the t-shirt that is white. When we have a blue background, the white t-shirt is best must avoid different colors and then in terms of styling painting and also the mass the man should not be drunkard all deaf in kenya they are celebrating a deaf deaf awareness week they should feel good they should also teach other sign language, should avoid drunkenness, laziness. Let's celebrate Deaf Awareness Week. Siddika here voicing. Goodbye. See you in my next video.